Hello students, welcome back to the channel. So today in this session we will be discussing operating system page replacement algorithm most important practice question. So this question will be asked in your college as well as your competitive examination. So watch this video carefully. So the question says consider the reference string. So one string is given here. If V4 that is first in first out page replacement algorithm is used then the number of page faults with three page frames and four page frames are what respectively. So as you can see in this question only one string is given and they want us to use V4 page replacement algorithm to find the page faults. But in this question the twist here is we have to use same algorithm on the same string with two different page frames. So first we need to solve the same string with three page faults, sorry three page frames and in second part we have to find out, we have to solve the same string by using four page frames, right? Also students, we have two different methods to solve fee for page replacement algorithm. One is the shortcut method that uh, will be helpful for your uh, competitive examination and one is the long or traditional method that will be helpful for your college examination. So we will solve three page faults wala section with your shortcut method and four page faults wala section with the traditional one. Okay, so watch this video carefully. At first, in the question three page frames are given okay so you can create three frames like this and focus on the given string okay so in the given string the first value is zero so we can write zero in the empty frame so zero was not already available in the frame so it was the first page fault next is 1. We can write 1 here that is one more page fault. Next value is true, uh, 2. So we can write 2 like this that is one more page fault. Right? Next value we have is 3. And now you can see there is no blank space available in the given frame. So now we need to replace any of the value to add 3 in the frame. And in this situation, what you need to do? You need to cut or you need to replace any of the three values. So what value you will replace will be based on the first in first out page replacement algorithm. Okay. So in this type of algorithm to add three, if you want to add three in the frame, just remove the third previous value. Because we are using three page frames, so we three values back. Jana hai. So one, two, three. That means you can replace three with zero. So this is one more page fault because three was not already available on the frame. Okay. Third, previously third value was zero. So we can replace it like this. Next is, next value is zero. So zero is not already available because we have replaced it with 3. So now if you want to add 0, you can replace 1, 2, 3, the third value that is 1. So cut 1 and add 0 here. Next value is 1 and if you want to add 1, write 1, 2, 3, replace it with 2. So replace replacing it with 2. Okay, so 1, 2, 3, 4, this was page fault for 0 and this is for 1. Okay. 3 page faults for 0, 1, 2 and 3 page faults now for 3, 0, 1. Next value is 4. As you can see here in the frame, 4 was not already available. So, 1, 2, 3 replace it with 3. So, write 4 as it is. This is one more page fault. Next value is 0. That is already available. So there is no need to replace. 1 is already available in the frame. So there is no need to replace it. Next value is 2. Now to replace 2, remove the last third value. So last third value for 2 is 1, 2, 3. So remove it like this. One more page fault is there. Next value is 3. 
one, two, three, we place it with zero. So three, one more page fault is there. Next value is four, and if you want to add four, right, replace it with one. So one more page fault is there. So total number of page faults we have to find. So for three page frames, the number of page fault will be one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. So for three page frames, the page fault is ten. Now we have to find the page fault for four page frames. So for this, we will use the traditional method. Okay, and for traditional method, you have to create, you have to make a table like this. In this table, or write all these strings as it is. Make four frames because we have, because it is given in the question, four page frames are there. Okay. Now, write 0 as it is. 0 was not already available. So, this is one page fault. 0 and 1. This is one more page fault. 0, 1 and 2. This is one more page fault. 0, 1, 2 and 3. This is one more page fault. Because these values were not already available in the frame. Now, the frame is full. We need to replace any value by using first in first out algorithm. And for that, Check the next value. Next value is 0. 0 is already available. So, there is no need to replace anything. Next value is 1. 1 is also already available. So, there is no need to replace any value till now. Okay. In the next step, value is 4. But as you can see here, there is no blank space for new value. And 4 is also not available. 4 is not already available in the frame. Now, in this step, we need to replace any value. And as first in first out algorithm says, the value that we have used, the value that, that has entered the frame first will be removed first. So as you can see here, the oldest value in the frame is 0. So we can remove 0 and add 4 in place of this, like this. So this is one more page fault. Now the next value is 0. 0 is not already available in the last frame. So, we need to replace one value. So, what you will replace? As you can see here, in case of 4, 1, 2 and 3, what is the oldest value? Oldest value is 1. After that 2 we have added, after that we, will add, we have added 3 and at last we have added 4. So, 1 is the oldest value among these. Uh, so, 1 is the oldest value among all these 4 terms. So, we can replace it like this. In, in place of uh, 1, you can write 0. So, this is one more page fault. Next value is 1. As you can see, 1 is not already available. So, replace any value 4, 0, 2, 3. So, the oldest value is 2. Because 2 ke baad 3 aya hai. 4 humne yaha se start kiya hai. And 0 humne yaha se start kiya hai. So, among these 4 values, the oldest value is 2. So, you can replace it like this. Baki ke value will remain as it is. So, this is one more page fault. Next value is 2. And for 2, what will be the, what will be the uh, value? So, 4, oldest value, 4 starts from here. 0 starts from here. 2 starts from, uh, sorry, 1 starts from here. And 3 starts from here. So, the oldest value among these 4 will be 3. So, we can replace it like this. So, this is one more page fault. Okay. 3 is not already available. Now, again, we have to replace any of the value. So, 4, 0, 1 and 2. So, 4 we have started from here. 0 we have started from here. 1 we have started from here. And 2 from here. As you can see right now, the oldest value among these 4 will be this. Okay. So, you can replace it like this. 1 and 2. Now, in the next step, what you can do? In the next step, you can see we have 3, 0, 1 and 2. See, so, oldest value among all these are 0. So, you can write 4 in place of 0. Baki will remain as it is. So, this is one more page fault. Okay. So, this is one more page fault. So, in this case, when we are using four page frames 
to find out the page faults. The number of page faults are 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8 and 9. So total page faults here are 9. Okay, so the correct answer will be the correct answer will be the uh, page faults with three page frames are 10 and four four page frames are nine. So this is your answer. I hope everything is clear. So this type of questions can be asked in your college as well as your competitive exams. So as you can see, we have used two different methods to solve the same question. You can use any of the method as per your convenience and especially for college level students, if you use a long method use karte ho, uh, for your 10 to 16 mark question, you will definitely get 10 out of 10 here. Okay, if you follow it like this. So, thank you so much for watching this session and all the best everyone.